How does simulation uh, and training help improve patient safety? I think in many ways. Um, innovation is all about impact. And to have impact, you need to have uh, several things in place, of course, uh, good medical science, uh, good technology. But that needs to be translated through uh, efficient education and uh, efficient local implementation. And we focus in particular on the latter two factors. Uh, and I think there is a big uh, paradigm shift uh, occurring in education. Um, simulation is uh, part of that. Uh, but also quality of, uh, uh, of education and uh, uh, an improvement or uh, maintenance of competence. And simulation can play a big role in that. Um, uh, several million Americans are being trained in, in uh, so-called so life support courses every year. Advanced life support course, uh, and PALS, uh, and so on. And for decades, the course, these courses have been uh, mandatory. And uh, uh, if you pass uh, a course, you'll get a certificate that uh, has a validity for two years. But uh, loads of uh, educational studies show that skills decay very rapidly unless you practice them under uh, inequality system. So this um, old uh, system of uh, taking a course, uh, getting a certificate for two years, and then repeating the same course, irrespective of your clinical practice, uh, has proven not to be very efficient. So now there is a shift towards low-dose, high-frequency, on-site or work-site training. And that is where simulation also can play a role. There are well over 1,000 uh, patient simulation centers in this country. How many? Well over 1,000. But I think too much, it's been a matter of our discussion of, of, of sort of brick and mortar and technology and, and, and simulators. We are privileged to supply many of those simulators, but it is not about the simulator. It is about the educational methodology, and it's about uh, the combination of an initial high dose uh, exposure and then the maintenance of that through a low dose, high frequency refresher training. And that should take place at the work site. So that's for the education, and I think this, this revolution is about to take place, and it can bring much, much enhanced impact of all the other things that are happening.